I think we wanted a film that was larger. The problems were larger. Uh, so the problems in Force 2 are larger. And uh, we wanted a character that's far more evolved than uh, the antagonist in Force 1. Um, and I always say this, you know, the strength is always here, not here. And uh, Tahir has got that strength of character in this film. Um, he's fantastic. And when you actually... Uh, you know, when you, when you see him, there's portions that I've seen in the film, and I'm speaking offhand, I shouldn't be saying this, Abine, but uh, I got goosebumps with certain portions of his, and you really feel for this character, which is fantastic. And uh, it's got so many shades and so many layers, so I think he adds so much value to this film, and the antagonist and the character in itself adds a lot of value in this film. It was actually a lot of uh, fun for me, and uh, it's uh, something that I, I'm, I've actually been very athletic even when I was in school. I used to enjoy playing sports, and I feel doing this kind of stuff puts me, liberates me in certain ways. So I, I was really excited to do the stunts that were told to me in this film. Uh, I feel like it was just a carry forward from Akira uh, doing the, in the action space, and I feel this was the right film to portray a different type of action, more sleek, more... Um, you know, stylized, very like amazing car chase sequences, high octane stunts and stuff. So it was really a fantastic ex experience. And um, I was <laughs> matching John step by step and he was very encouraging. And uh, even though he made fun of me every now and then, but uh, at the end of the day, he appreciated my work, which is uh, what counts. And I guess everybody was happy. So uh, that makes me happy.